I can honestly say that meeting you uh, was one of the most impactful moments of my entire life and changed the course of my life for very much for the better. Uh, getting cast as Perchick and Fiddler on the Roof, figuring out very quickly that I needed to learn how to sing, you know, set my, my life off on a very different direction than it ever was other would have been. Many, many great memories with you. Uh, one that really sticks out uh, in my mind was this moment where um, we were rehearsing Tears in Heaven by Eric Clapton, and you were playing piano. And I was trying to sing it just like Eric Clapton. And you said, Rich, no, 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 no. Please don't try to sing like Eric Clapton. Sing like Rich Ortiz. That moment really made an impact on my life. And possibly the highlight of my high school career. And the memory is from something that I probably should not have taken, but I have carried with me all these years. And it's actually the bow tie that I wore as Willard at the prom scene to conclude the show, and uh, I think it's real symbolic of just the time I had uh, at, under your tutelage as in chorus and in, in the musical. Um, Cinderella was the first show that I saw at BHS. I was in sixth grade in middle school, and I saw it, and I went home that night, and I said, this is what I want to do with my life. You have to know that my time with you um, and doing the shows at BHS uh, was so influential to me. I am still pursuing theater as a career even today. You saw the potential in me at such an early age and fostered a love for music and theater. You gave me world-class experiences and training that I'm so grateful for. When I was young, you made me feel accepted and helped me figure out who I was. But I also want to give you the thank you note that I never wrote you, that I never gave to you, which was giving me the most incredible experience in high school of finding a community that I felt I finally belonged in. Then I would say most, uh, or perhaps not the least of which, uh, for giving me my best friend in the whole world who is filming us right now. It's us again. Can you believe it? Is that not a twist? We did it. Put your mask on. Put your oh, mask on. Right, it's COVID. Jeez. And those seminal years for me were so important. Uh, you instilled in me such important bedrock qualities that I still carry with myself to this day. And I've taken all of these philosophies into my own work. The work you did at Spring Lake Central alone 
will never be forgotten by anyone who was there to witness it. We managed to take a school with roughly, I don't know, 20 kids <laughs> per grade, and that was a big class. And you transformed the, the theater program completely to the point that people still talk about the shows you directed all these years later. At least three things defined a Kathleen Donovan Warren show. The tightest of harmonies, a stage brimming with kids, and a spree decor. For a few years there, it seemed every time I showed up at Pleasantville, I found a crew kid joyfully trying to build a horse. You had kids building horses, Kathleen. I can say that my time with you and at Briarcliff High School was really pivotal for me. I'm happy to say that I'm finishing up my 15th year being a drama teacher, so I would say that you had a big part of influencing me and, and putting me on that path. I was fortunate enough to get to interact with your students, to see your amazing work on stage, and I know how grateful your students are to you. From NISMA and CASMA and um, select chorus and regular chorus and plays and musicals and all that awesome stuff, it's really interesting to look back on that as an adult and realize the amount of time and energy that you put into all of that and into giving us those opportunities when you didn't have to do that at all. Briarcliff and Pleasantville were the luckiest districts in the country um, to have you leading their theater program, and I mean that. Without you, I never would have, you're the one who 20 years ago, the 20 years ago this fall, if you can believe it, asked me to audition for Cinderella, and I started singing and then gave me the confidence that sent me out into the world to do what I did. And you are not small talk, or shiny cars, or mirrors, or French cologne. You are the river, the moon, the stars. You're no one else I've known. I was lucky enough to learn from you for four years at Pleasant High School, and I really do mean lucky. From you, I was able to figure out what my passions were in life, to perform musicals, to perform opera, to sing classical music. I just finished up my bachelor's degree at Eastman, and next year I'll be applying for Masters of Music, and without you, I wouldn't have been able to do any of that. So from the bottom of my heart, this is why. Thank you so much.
and my community live. You helped me find those two very essential things back in Briarcliff, and the theater is what feeds them now. Thank you. I could while away the hours conferring with the flowers, consulting with the rain. Mrs. Warren, congratulations on an amazing career inspiring children and teaching music. Just wanted to thank you personally for all you've done to inspire me as a young student. I just wanted to thank you for all of the work that you've done and for putting up with me. Thank you so much. And I wish you the best of luck in all of your future endeavors. Kathleen, I'm so grateful to have been included in your wonderful projects. I remember the night all the lights went out and we blew a fuse during Joseph. You remember that? I love you, my friend. Have fun. Sending you a lot of love. Congratulations. Enjoy your retirement. Take a couple months, years off, or don't, and call me and we can collaborate on something. Um, all the best to you. Lots of love. I just wanted to say thank you so much for giving me all the tools that I need to pursue a career in musical theater. You've inspired me every day to follow my dreams and do what I love to do most. I can't wait to see what you do next. You've touched so many hearts and changed so many lives and congratulations on your retirement. Thank you very much. Enjoy your retirement. It is well deserved. I hope you have lots of fun and know how much you are appreciated and loved. Sending you so much love. Congratulations. Congratulations again, enjoy it, and I hope to see you again soon. It's been such a pleasure knowing you. Here's to the next chapter for you. Thank you so much, and I wish you the best rest and most fulfilling retirement. Thanks. But now it's your turn to focus on yourself. I can't wait to see what you accomplish in retirement. Take a break, and when you're ready to start directing again, let me know, because I will be in a Kathleen Donovan and Warren show any day of the week. I'm, I'm so thankful that you came into our lives when you did. And you really, you really are one of the greatest of all time. 